Imagine making a career out of operating a remote control. Well, you can if you become a remotely operated vehicle pilot. Remotely operated vehicle pilots carry out a variety of specialized functions by operating robotic vehicles that are remotely controlled. Remotely operated vehicles vary in size, weight and complexity and are piloted by the operator from a particular locality while the machine performs its assigned task in another location. Remotely operated vehicles, commonly known as ROVs, offer a range of effective solutions for subsea projects. Explore remote and undersea locations in the offshore oil and gas industry and do repairs in places with high hydraulic pressure. Unmanned aerial vehicles, or UAVs, carry out a vast number of tasks from the sky. These may include topography surveying or search and rescue operations. Remotely operated vehicle pilots or ROV pilots navigate and maneuver these robotic vehicles while watching out for and avoiding any potential hazards. It is the responsibility of the ROV pilots to maintain and repair remotely operated vehicles and all their associated equipment, tools and systems. ROV pilots can work both indoors and outdoors. The outside working environment can at times be challenging and remotely operated vehicle pilots can find themselves working in all types of weather conditions. ROV pilots work alone or in a team. They should also be analytical and good at solving problems. To become an ROV pilot in the marine industry, you need a qualification or have technical experience either in the electrical or electronic fields, otherwise in the hydraulic or mechanical fields. You need to complete training provided by private training providers. You can then progress from trainee to pilot technician, to senior pilot, to supervisor, to finally a superintendent. It takes a minimum of five years to gain enough work experience and operating hours to become a superintendent. To become a remotely operated vehicle pilot of aerial vehicles, you can enlist with the South African National Defence Force. You will first have to meet their enrolment requirements and complete a two-year military skills development program before accessing training that will lead to this occupation. Alternatively, employers who use remotely operated vehicle pilots have their own entry requirements and provide their own training. Working as a remotely operated vehicle pilot can be challenging, but if you work well under pressure and are technically orientated with excellent attention to detail, then this exciting lifestyle could be just the career for you.